Well, good evening once again. The Buffalo City Council back to the drawing board today, trying to improve its snow response plan before any other storms hit our region. Among the items up for discussion, securing new equipment for Buffalo's bravest. The union for the city's fire department says last month's blizzard, quote, shine a glaring light on the shortcomings of the department's infrastructure. In this statement, the union goes on to say that crews are using rigs that endanger members and the public, and they have, quote, may do with equipment that is outdated and obsolete. Now, these concerns caught the attention of Buffalo South District Council member Chris Scanlon. Earlier this month, he put forward some recommendations that the city could implement ahead of the next storm. That list included using American Rescue Plan money to buy new equipment for the police and fire departments. That's where 7 News reporter Kristen Moran picks up the story live for us tonight in Buffalo. Kristen. Right. Well, Jeff, this was really the first time City Council came together to discuss those resolutions and those proposals as to how the city can move forward when it comes to responding to storms uh, and what leaders can we even learn from it. Common Council members Mitch Nowakowski and Chris Scanlon's proposals took center stage. Nowakowski pushing for an inquiry into the city's response to the blizzard. Other Common Council members spoke in support of this, like Rashid Wyatt, saying the inquiry isn't to point fingers, but to learn from the storm and to do better moving forward. Scanlon released a slew of those resolutions that you mentioned, Jeff, including reallocating federal funds to buy what he says is crucial and necessary equipment for the city's departments, including the Buffalo Fire Department, local to a two union president for the Buffalo firefighters, Vinny Ventresca, telling me the new equipment is crucial. I mean, we're a busy, active, aggressive fire department, and we're just looking for them to get on some type of, make an immediate purchase and get on some type of regular purchase plan so that we can have the apparatus we need. Ventresca also telling me they feel the fleet has been ignored for a long time. He says the blizzard shined a light on some overdue changes that need to happen within the fire department. He also tells me they're looking forward to this support from council members and looking forward to seeing that change sometime soon. So I do reach out to a city spokesperson regarding some of the fire department's complaints. I'm told that since 2018, millions of dollars have been spent for new equipment for the fire department. A new firehouse is in the works in South Buffalo, and he says the age of the fleet had nothing to do with the department's response to this past blizzard that we have. We're live in downtown Buffalo tonight. Kristen Moran, 7 News. All right. Thank you, Kristen.